We often get asked, are your devices GPS enabled? And the answer is no, um, because we don't want them to be. And the reasons that we don't want them to be is cost and space. Uh, the third reason, more importantly, is where we're at in the outdoors, we don't often have a cellular signal or Wi-Fi to actually enable that GPS. So what we did is we developed Bluetooth-enabled connected devices that connect to your smartphone. The reason that's a benefit is, one, it uses all the technology on your phone, and as soon as you do have a connection, cellularly, which you've already paid for, that immediately goes up to the cloud and everything is updated. It also does it instantly if you're in an area that has cellular connectivity. Um, from a Bluetooth standpoint, much more affordable. So from a Bluetooth uh, board, never fit it in here if it was GPS, but we can with Bluetooth for the first time. We spent two years developing that. So it's not even feasible in this guy. If we did GPS and the location markers, that would work, but both devices would be incredibly expensive and you'd have to have a separate subscription with a cellular company for them to actually activate or work or be connected. Um, unless it was Wi-Fi enabled, and I don't have many hunting spots where I have Wi-Fi throughout. Uh, you know, the other challenge with that, think about having six of these in your quiver and having to have six subscription plans, or having one of these on each of your stand locations, your camera locations, your blinds. You have one hopefully in your safety vest and your buddies do. That's a lot of subscriptions. So we went Bluetooth because all the technology works, and then if you're out in the field, you can actually connect via your phone, which GPS only goes up and back. It wouldn't go out to the device. The, the device can connect via your phone, you can get close, you can activate it whether it's 100, 150 yards or 50 yards, and you can do everything it needs to do. And then when you get back home again, everything is updated to the cloud, you're good to go, so when you share that device, uh, that person sees it on the map, last location, and all the things that we want for the functionality. So that's why we're Bluetooth and not GPS, although your phone makes it a GPS device.